It's about 11.44, and I've had this um, email in my inbox <sighs> since 10.15 with my exam in it, and I'm not allowed to open it till noon. I hate needing to wait. I would have much preferred just getting up early and doing this. So, it's fun. That's why I'm just kind of hanging out and waiting because there's nothing I can do to study more at this point. I just hate waiting. Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Um, this is my second update for my exams. Um, yeah, it was probably way harder than I anticipated and I kind of knew it was going to be really hard. So that's why I'm just going to quickly talk a little bit about the exam and how I felt after and how I feel now because um, I definitely waited longer than 24 hours to make this video because I just needed a mental break. My last exam was eight hours long. Um, I got the exam, I think it was like at 740 and I had eight hours to complete it, and it was 11 questions. This one was six hours um, with six questions, so um, relatively longer period of time per question, um, I suppose. And I think it was so overwhelming because right off the bat, um, well, first, I got the exam before I was allowed to open it, so I had to sit with a... Um, I think it was like an hour that I was sitting in my inbox. So I'm just like staring at the computer screen. Um, so I definitely did not like having to wait to start the exam. Um, but after I opened it, the very first question, um, I really could not answer it basically in any capacity. So that first question was a list of 16 different um, ecologists and it was what did they do and uh, what were their major experiments and I only knew two of them and I, I felt like I knew quite a bit about major ecologists um, but I think it's because um, the ones that I'm very familiar with are like really old school ecologists um, but yeah it was it was rough and then the second question that I had a really hard time with like there was three questions that I felt like I could answer uh, pretty well there was one question that I felt that I didn't know the answer to, but I could at least talk about it, and that was my longest response. And then there were um, that question that with the scientists that I just bombed, and then another one with an equation and wanting me to adapt an equation that I didn't memorize. And the thing I think was the most frustrating about it is one, I was reading that chapter over again before I took the exam just because I had extra time that morning. And so I was looking I was looking over that exact chapter and I couldn't remember the actual equation to save my life. Um, so that's something that I need to figure out and uh, correct. And what was the other one? There was one other one that I struggled with. Um, oh the one that I answered pretty long, it was asking about wavelength of light uh, that different vertebrate animals can see. So my research is looking at competition between vertebrate animals and arthropods for um, carcasses. And um, so I'm an entomologist. I, I didn't even think to um, look at what wavelength of light uh, that different animals looked at. So I just, I guess I'm just disappointed that uh, I could have prepared better. Um, so hopefully I did good enough that I, I at least pass and I can just correct it um, for the uh, oral exam. Um, the one good thing that, uh, actually I'll get to that after. Um, after the exam, I sat down on my deck and I just laid on the deck looking at the sky because my advisor had sent me the exam and um because the person who created the exam was traveling so um i sent it back to my advisor and um 
the committee member and uh, my advisor looked it over and he's like, you did good. And I was like, no, I did horrible. I feel like I did horrible. I feel like I'm dying. I feel like the world is crashing down right now. So I, I mean, I'm sure I didn't do horrible, but I feel like I did horrible. And I think that's what um, is really eating at me is I, I wish I did um, things a little differently, I guess, like preparing for it. But I mean, there's really nothing I can do about it now. Um, I basically, after I talked to him on the phone, my advisor, um, I went and got ice cream and just kind of chilled in the bath the entire night. And then yesterday, the entire day, I, I was basically just editing things, just doing like simple tasks to try to, um, keep me distracted from how upset I am. Um, but now I, I feel okay now. So... I guess it's just getting over it. So I'm just hoping from here on out the exams aren't uh, that bad. Not that bad. Just I don't perform that bad because I just feel like I did really bad. But um, we'll see. Uh, my next exam is in a day and a half. I think I get it at 8 a.m. Um, on Monday, so... That's, that'll be that. Until then, I'm just kind of uh, going over my notes and um, brushing up on things so I have it fresh in my memory. Um, but at this point, there's really nothing else I can do until um, I take the exam and figure out uh, where I need to improve. Although, one thing that was good, uh, I got a pass for my first exam. So I got my email back um, saying that, you know, I had some questions that I do need to brush up on, but it wasn't anything I didn't expect, so that was good. So until uh, my next video, I will see everyone later. Um, thank you for watching. Mm -hmm.